In agricultural news from agview.net, the dates have been set for the first two KLA Kansas State University Ranch Management Field Days in this series. High Plains Ponderosa Dairy, which is a state-of-the-art commercial milking operation, will host the first event August 13th in southwest Kansas near Plains. Then Jarrett and Shawna Moyer, Moyer Farms LLC, will host a second field day on August the 15th. Moyer family owns and operates a stalker operation just north of Emporia. Those field days will include presentations on the history of the host operations as well as the practices that are used today and educational sessions and of course a delicious beef dinner. Sponsors for the event, Farm Credit Associations of Kansas as well as Bayer Animal Health. Well, a bipartisan group of senators has introduced legislation to address a shortage of agriculture inspectors who protect the nation's food supply and ag industries at the border. Ag inspectors work to prevent the intentional or unintentional entry of harmful plants, food and animals and goods into the U.S. The Protecting America's Food and Agriculture Act of 2019 would ensure the safe and secure trade of agricultural goods across our nation's border by authorizing the U.S. Customs and Border Protection to hire additional inspectors to fully staff America's ports of entry. Senate Ag Chairman Pat Roberts of Kansas, one of several authors of the legislation, he says that every day millions of pounds of produce, meat and other agriculture goods enter the U.S. through our ports of entry. He said ag inspectors are responsible for ensuring that the goods move efficiently across the border while safeguarding against harmful pests, diseases and even potential bioterrorism attacks. Find more ag news at agview.net. Stay with us. We'll have more in a moment.